Hey everybody, Epiphany here, and today's video was suggested in the comments by Kiddish, and he wants me to make a video on mistakes people make as an entry fragger. Now, if you all enjoy this video, then definitely be sure to hit that like button. 10 likes would be amazing. You guys have been killing the likes by at least 5 to 10 more likes, and I just, I can't thank you guys enough. I appreciate it so much, so thank you. Also, if you missed out on yesterday's video or want to see something different, then be sure to click that cue card up in the top right corner for a video on spray control tips now starting off with today's video i want to thank kiddish for suggesting this video as there are many mistakes people make can make as an entry fragger and they may not even realize it so the first thing many people who are trying to take on that entry fragger role do they tend to start to push or peak before you know the pop flash has already been thrown so with that they may already be halfway out and end up having to turn their backs. Now, there are some pop flashes that could easily be thrown to help with that so the intrafragger doesn't have to turn, but the easiest way to help with this is simply communicate with your team, whether it be your actual team, a team in the SEA, or even a team in matchmaking. It only takes a few seconds to ask if someone has a flash and if they can flash you in. Now, another mistake people make as intrafraggers is not getting or having enough information before they push onto the site. Yes, you can have have those fast plays where you bum rush the site and get right in and push the CTs off but there are many times where I see people try to take on that entry fragger role and they rush into the sites with little to no information when the team isn't even doing a fast play and because of having a little to no information they don't have an, a decent idea of where people are and instantly die now that could easily be fixed by just communicating with your team on whether you're going to do a fast play or not and also you know just peeking here and there to get an idea of where each person is on each site and then go from there and pick which site you want to take so that at least you have some kind of information to go off of now the next mistake people make as an entry fragger is not fully communicating with their team this does go along with the first mistake about not communicating with flashes but many people will not communicate to when they're pushing and this is extremely important so that way if you die you will at least have your teammate as a backup to either save you or at least trade the kill and many people just you know as I said just rush under the sites and don't really communicate with their team a whole lot so there is no one to normally trade that kill and then you die for no reason and then your team is down a man now the final mistake many people make as entry fraggers is trying to fill the role when they are really better off playing a different role an entry fragger should know the main areas people play should have quick reaction time and should communicate with this team well now they are the person on your team that is a key player and needs to get those entries or at least create a gap for someone else to secure the first kill onto a site they should also have a very good aim and spray control and be able to win those 1v1s or at least do enough damage so the team can easily clean up within seconds Overall, these are just some mistakes that people tend to make as an entry fragger, and they are also things that are have very easy fixes to them as well. Now, I really hope you all enjoyed this video, and I also hope it brought some common issues to light, so that way you don't find yourself doing these things. Now, I want to thank you again to Kiddish, and if you guys have any other videos you want to suggest in the comments, then definitely be sure to leave a comment below, and if you did like this video, then be sure to drop a like. My name is Epithemy, and I'll catch you all next time.